the, the thing I was hanging out for the most was a dog squad. So I did that on a Monday and Tuesday. And, um, you know, I was a bit worried about the vision getting put out there because I got to put like a bite sleeve on and the yeah. dogs attacking me and stuff. But um, I came out unscathed. So I think Flegs and, and Shell were pretty happy with that. <laughs> any any arrests made moves or any wild stories for us? <clears throat> um, they made me be a... I guess a perpetrator oh, one day and put yeah. me in a in a sleeve and this dog um trained police dog dragged me out of the car and they arrested me like that so that was quite fun but no nah, no arrests on on my behalf but um yeah it was a really good insight to how it all works at the QPS and, and sort of what they do um day in day out to keep the community safe yeah, it's obviously pretty different from cricket, but was there anything you picked up there that can can help you as an elite cricketer? Yes and no. I think there's probably similar in terms of the teamwork side of things. Um, you know, I just think sometimes I'm a bit like I just all I do is hit a ball around a field when I'm actually contributing to society. Oh, so <laughs> <laughs> um, might be nice to do something that contributes a little bit more. It was just awesome to be a, you know a normal person learning about a different job and trying to. Um, you know, get some more people signed up. I think they've had a lot of issues with retention in the police mm. force you know, service in Queensland. So um, if I could sort of shine a bit of a light on what they do and how important it is and, and that they're very good, then they've done my job.